Hi everyone, welcome back to the Native Family. If you are new here, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you have not already. If you're returning, hey family, I have a 99 cent store haul for you guys. And it this was a stock up trip. Whenever I can find something that I purchase at regular stores for full price and I can get it at the 99 cent store for 99 cents or maybe even a little more, I will pick it up and I will stock up. So I'm going to go ahead and get into what I found so I can show you guys all of this so I can get it put away. <coughs> Sorry, my allergies are killing me today. They did have the craft um, twist. It's the mozzarella and cheddar and you get 12 snacks. It's already open because I had the girls with me and they were starving. So they said that they needed a cheese stick. Excuse my fingernails. I have to do my nails again. But you get six grams of protein per snack. Um, the expiration date is January 30th, but we'll get through these pretty quick. We do have a road trip that we're going on on Saturday, so I'm going to be packing a lot of snacks, so I will be including some of these. So I picked up three of these. My store actually got quite a bit in, so if you see a lot, I didn't buy it all, I promise. I shared. Then they had these uh, craft with a touch of Philadelphia um, Creamy Milk Kobe Jack. And this is an 8 ounce bag, and these are good until, oh, I know I saw the date on these. Oh my goodness. Okay, I can't find the date. Oh, and there it is, March 2nd. So I did pick up one, two, three, five, six, seven bags of these, and I will be putting these in the freezer because if you guys watch my other hauls, you know that I do buy a lot of shredded cheese. So when I can get it, you know, at a price like that, I'm going to stock up. And then they had lunch meats, and there was two different kinds. This is the smoked Foster Farms turkey variety, so you get oven-roasted turkey breast. Sorry about the glare, guys. Smoked turkey breast and turkey ham. This is good by uh, February 19th, so these will be going two in the fridge and one in, or the rest in the freezer. And like I said, with the trip, I am going to be making deli sandwiches, so this came at a perfect time. So I did pick up two packages of this variety here, which is the smoked variety. And then I got four packages of the honey cured turkey breast, the smoked turkey breast, and the oven roasted. So this is awesome, especially if you guys have to do lunches for the kids and things like that. Perfect, perfect. So that is exactly why I stocked up there. I did get two bags of these Dan D Pack walnuts. They're three ounces, and the size of these walnuts are huge. These are perfect for snacking. Um, they're perfect for baking, so I do like to keep them in the house. Rhiannon has odd taste. She loves Spam. Nobody else in the house will eat Spam. I'll eat it a little bit, but she likes it. So I did pick her up a couple of the Spam Single Classic. I know it was probably cheaper if I got one of the big cans, but she just won't go through it fast enough, and I don't want it to waste. So I picked her up three packages of those. And then for the trip, I thought I would take some uh, tuna. And they only had two varieties. They had the Chicken of the Sea and the Bumblebee. And both of them are light tuna and water. So those will be for preparation for the trip. Also, I did pick up one of the on-the-border um, salsa con queso for $1.99. This is the big jar. And I did pick up the other cantina thins from on the border, so we'll be taking those with us to the trip as well. Okay, so I needed a new hand mixer. I did, <laughs> when uh, Donna from Mom Lay 7 came to um, visit, she had borrowed my hand mixer, and I hadn't used my hand mixer in years because I mix all my doughs and everything in my uh, Ninja processor. So I didn't know the girls had like lost pieces to it. It didn't match, so... I threw away the ratchet one, and I picked up this one. It's $5.99, and it's by the company Pip. It's a five-speed electric hand mixer. So I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. Hopefully it works. Um, Non-food items. Smoke and Mirrors has been coming out with some really pretty colors, and I love these colors. And it's in I Am The One, and they're beautiful colors. So I did just pick up the one. They had a, no, a nude and a couple other ones. If you guys follow me on Instagram... I do post a lot of things that I don't purchase, so it is the Native Family, just like the channel name, and you'll be able to see more things that I didn't pick up. Then they had this uh, Extreme Long Lash Mascara, and I don't know, it's by Smoke and Mirrors, so I'm going to give that a try. It says 24-hour sweat-proof mascara. I do like to wear waterproof um, eyeliner and mascara, so I picked that up to give it a try. I saw Mama for Nicole pick these up. And this is the Translucent Powder Matte Finish. So I picked up two. It's for Shine Control. I got one for Rhiannon and one for Angelina. So hopefully these work. I did also pick up a beautiful brand. I'm not sure. It says Brown Sugar. 
and this is a bronzer. So I thought this was a really pretty color for me and the girls to give a try. Um, TMI, the hubby works and he wears steel-toed boots. So his nails are kind of funky. So I did pick him up the Nel Nelner Healthy Brighter Nails Nail Renewal Pin. So <laughs> if it works, I'll let you guys know. Um, for the trip, I did pick up a couple snacks because if you guys know when you take a road trip with kids and you go to gas up, they want to buy everything at the gas station and it gets pricey. So I picked up some of these. They are the Australian style Walla, Willy Wallaby Gourmet Red Licorice. These are so good. I tasted one once and they taste like um, Hawaiian Punch. They're so good. So I picked those up for the road. Healthier snack a little bit, even though it has chocolate on it. They have the Dove Cashews dipped in silky smooth milk chocolate. And it is a five ounce bag and they're $1.99, but anything to do with cashews and things like that tend to be a little bit more spendy. So I did pick up two bags of the Dove Cashews and I picked up one bag of the almonds because the hubby prefers almonds. So we have those to snack on. I'm going to try to get over here because I'm set up kind of funky today. Um, I think I've seen Sway to the 99 pick these up. These are the chocolate covered pineapple bars. Um, they're Keep Healthy Fruit Keys. So I picked up two of those. I oh, Oops, dropping things. I always keep gum in my purse, and the girls are the same way. The hubby likes to have it in the car. So I just picked up some Mentos gum, some Dentine, and some Eclipse. And then they had the Gold Peak Tea and the Sweet Tea. This is one of the hubby's favorites, and I generally don't make sweet tea at home. When I do make tea, it is unsweetened. So I thought that I would get this for a treat for him to have on the road trip, and I picked up two of them. They had so much of it, but why buy a whole bunch if you're not going to get through it, you know? Also, for the trip, I did pick up some of these Kool-Aid sparklers, and you guys have all seen these. They brought them back out. I'm hoping to find the Tropical Punch one because I was wondering how that would be. So these are for the road trip as well. I needed some more feta cheese for my salads, and I wasn't going to go to any other grocery stores today. It is $2.99, but you get quite a bit in here, and the quality is pretty good, so I got those for my wedge salads. Now, this, I think, was my score of the day. I love prosciutto, and I found the prosciutto di San Daniel, and it's made in Italy. Principe is the brand, I believe, and you get three ounces. It's good till February 6th of 2019. Prosciutto is expensive, so it was only 99 cents, so I picked up four packages of this. I was hoping my 99 was going to have asparagus today. They didn't have any, so I do need to go pick up some asparagus because I want to make that with dinner tonight. And what I do is I just wrap the prosciutto around the asparagus, and you bake it, and it's so yummy. But it's usually too expensive, but for 99 cents, you cannot beat that. And I know it's keto-friendly keto if you guys are on a keto diet, so that's an awesome find there, too. I think that's everything oh no okay so everybody's doing the decluttering because that's what most of us do in January every January I do this in every I want to say um, about every six months so I'll probably do it again probably around June or July as I do the 30 day 30 bag challenge so every day I try to fill a bag in a different room of the house until I have 30 bags full either to get rid of, throw away, donate, you know, if you're not using it, things to go through. So I did pick up these Value Pack 21 Easy Closing Multi-Purpose Bags. You get 48 bags for $3.99, so I did pick that up for my project. I just time to do de declutter, organize. Now, my favorite body soap is Caress, and they did have the Caress Pure um, Embrace for $2.99. This smells amazing, guys. So I did pick up two of those because I really want to learn how to coupon. And you guys know it's not a haul unless my... Sorry about that, guys. You know that my phone rings when I have a haul. <laughs> it's just how it works. <clears throat> and I forgot what I was saying. Anyways, that's my favorite soap. So when I find it, I'm not a couponer. I want to learn how to coupon. I picked that up because to me that's a good price. It's like getting two for the price of one. But this is my haul, this is what I do. This is one of the reasons why I do shop at the 99. So when we do find things like lunch meat or cheese or anything like that, and we can stock up and we can make sure our family is going to have enough groceries or you know, goodies and things like that, it really makes it affordable. The things I do in my videos, I'm doing this for my family and I enjoy sharing it with you guys. 
I'm not doing this to compete with anybody. I promise. This is just how we live. And I appreciate every single one of you guys' support. Don't forget to inspire, be inspired, be nice, say something nice to someone, smile at someone. And remember, you know, it, it's okay. We're, we're happy people. Just be happy. I hope everybody is doing well. And if you guys like this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up. And I hope all is well with everybody. Thanks.